We know that hosting webinars from home has become the norm and not everyone has a dedicated office or studio setup. But having the right background is crucial for a professional and engaging webinar. So in this video we are going to show you how you can create a virtual background using Webinar Geek and an external software like Mmm App. Let's get started. Before we start, let me explain what a virtual background is. A virtual background uses the same chroma key technology used with a green screen. The color of your background is made transparent and can then be replaced with whatever image you choose. The result? Your subject is visible on your background. A virtual background works the same. However, instead of using a physical green or blue screen, which will be made transparent, a virtual background keys out everything in the frame but the subject. The result? Anything in your background will be replaced with an image of your choice. Option 1. Using Webinar Geek. First, make sure you have a Webinar Geek account. If you don't have one, sign up. It's simple. And if you encounter any trouble, please contact our wonderful support team. Activating a virtual background in Webinar Geek is pretty similar to well-known meeting tools like Google Meet. If you are in a preview or live environment, look for the sparkles icon. Clicking this icon will open up a menu where you can choose between a blurred background or an image. If you prefer a blurred background, select one of the top three icons. You can also adjust the intensity of your blur to your liking. If you prefer an image, simply choose your favorite image from the library or upload your own background image. And now your virtual background is activated. Option 2. External software. If you're looking for more advanced options to edit your background, you can use an external software like Mmm -hmm App or OBS. But you can also use hardware like the Blackmagic 8 Mini Pro for physical green screen setup. Simply set up your virtual background in your preferred software or hardware. Open the Webinar Geek app and start your live webinar via the Open Live Webinar button. Head over to Settings and choose the name of the software you are using as a camera input. Right now, your virtual background will be shown in the Webinar Geek environment. And there you have it, creating captivating virtual backgrounds. Whether you are using Webinar Geek's built-in features or go the extra mile with a different tool, you are sure to impress your audience with a professional setup. And that's it. If you enjoyed this video and you want to learn more about webinars on how to host them, what gear to use and what it is like to work at a tech startup, subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click like on this video and hit that notification bell. And let me know, have you ever used a virtual background? Thank you so much for watching and see you on the next one. Bye!